Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Nestling Padasale. So this video will be really helpful for those students who wrote this joint CSRGC in June 2022 examination. I know many of you will be eagerly waiting for downloading the finalized answer key because in the finalized answer key only we can know for what are the questions NTA has reframed the option. So in this video, I'm going to tell you a real outcome like what if NTA accepts the answer key. Okay, so this video I will be providing you a detailed explanation friends. So please watch the video continuously. So first I'll be explaining for shift one questions and then for shift to question first. So here I had given a question ID. Next, the provisional answer key, and this is a final answer key that is after child. So, so either along with the result or after releasing the scorecard, uh, NTA will be releasing a finalized answer key, and this is the outcome. This is for shift one life census student question paper. You can take. So, first is with regarding to question ID 33, that is biomes in India. So, in the provisional answer key, they just mentioned option number 132. But uh, what's a uh, finalized answer key? You can expect all options are correct. So, marks will be given for those students who attempted this question. Okay. Okay, irrespective whether you are attempted wrong option or correct option. Next is with regarding to question number 56, that is with regarding to alpha helix. So they had given a structure and they'll ask us to find the length, turn, and number of hydrogen bond. In the, in the provision answer key, they just mentioned option number 221 is correct option, but when we work out, no option is correct. Okay, so all the answer given by NDA is absolutely wrong. So again, mark will be given for those who are attempted the question. Next is with regarding to question number 63, that is nucleated excision repair. And the provision answer key, they just mentioned only option number 252 alone is correct option. In final answer key, you can expect both 251 option and 252 option are absolutely correct. It is option number B, C, D as well as C, D. If you are selected either of two options, then marks will be given only for those who are selected either 251 option ID or 252 option ID. If you are selected some other option ID means you won't be getting no mark, you will be getting a negative mark. Okay. Next is with regarding to question number 76 that is in the provisional answer key, they just mentioned option number 3 now 2 is correct option like that they mentioned. They uh, so many are uh, students are telling zygote is a totally different stem cells. I don't know, but according to my knowledge, definitely this question will be considered as a drop the questions. And again, mark will be given for those who attempted this question. Next is question number 99, which is food crops and the domestication. So in the provision answer key, they just mentioned 394 option is a correct thing. But according to my knowledge, and still many students have done an in intense research, and what according to my knowledge, no option is correct. So definitely marks will be given for those who attempted this uh, attempted this question. So this question. Will be considered as a drop requested. Next, with regarding to question number 58, that is with regarding to chromatin remodeling. So, the provision answer key they just mentioned uh, two, 231 option, that is B, C, E option are absolutely correct like that as you mentioned but uh, many students doubting e option that is with regarding to phosphorylation of histone has ultimately providing a transcription repression like that they had given but when we refer the lodish book we just identified uh, phosphorylation of histone at that particular serine question will be ultimately leading to transcription activation so i don't know about this particular question so some other students are showing me few research article where in that research article they are selling when the phosphor uh, the histone is phosphorylated serine question it will be leading to transcription repression so definitely this there are chances for making this particular option ID is also dropped question. So marks will be allotted for those who attempted this question. Okay. Next is regarding to question number 88. That is uh, in that particular provision answer key, they just mentioned option number 349 is the correct option like that they mentioned with regarding to this particular pituitary hormone. That is, they just mentioned uh, option number uh, a, C, D are incorrect. Like they were asking you to choose the incorrect combination. So many students are doubting this particular option is absolutely correct. But when I refer, this option is again an incorrect statement. Okay. So, so here you can able to see uh, this for this particular question, you can't able to expect uh, any change in option. So marks will be given for those students who have given only 349 as the option. Okay. So when I refer an article from Science Direct, they just mentioned with regarding to this MSH hormone that is alpha and beta are secreted from. Here they just mentioned they are secreted from adult human. No, they are not even secreted in human. They are secreted in some other animals like rat. Okay. So for this question only, if you are selected three, 349 option, you will be getting a mark or else you won't get no mark at all. Okay. So if you select some other option means you will be getting a negative mark. Next is with regarding to question number 136. That is a bar chart related question asked in part A. So in the provision answer key, they just mentioned three. 341 as an sorry 541 as an correct option but according to me both 541 as well as 543 are absolutely correct option so mark will be given for those students who attempted either 541 option or 543 option only if you are selected either two option you will be getting a mark next is regarding to question number 72 
that is with regard to IG super family in the provision answer key they just mentioned 288 is the correct option but many students are demanding with regarding to that last option okay so definitely this question will be considered as a drop the question because in Albert Bruce book uh, definitely uh, they had given a clear statement with regarding to that particular thing but here for this particular question I can tell you there are 50% chances to accept our claim and there are 50% chances to reject our claim so this is with regarding to shift one question paper. So next we can go for shift two question paper. So first question ID is 226. Ultimately, that's a lack is that. So the provision answer key, they just mentioned 902 is a correct option, but uh, there was no mistake in option. There was a mistake in question. So they had given four statement, but in that four statement, option A, uh, that is statement number A and shift statement number D are absolutely same statement. So that's a mistake in question. That might be due to any typing error or human error. So in that case, 226 option will be considered drop requesting and marks will be awarded for all those children who attempted this question only if you attempt that question you'll be getting a four mark or else you won't get no mark at all okay so next is regarding to question number 231 that is with regarding to transcriptional start side so with regarding to that particular question i know many are uh, telling that particular question is absolutely wrong but according to me the question is fine and the provisional answer key also absolutely wrong. that is only c statement is alone correct so for this particular question there will be no change only if you are marked the question number of the test uh, student will be awarded four mark only if you had selected option id 921 next is regarding to question number 241 that is with regard to overall development in CL again so in the provision answer key they just mentioned option number 962 so here you can be able to see in the provision answer key they just mentioned only B and C option are on correct but when we refer the Gilbert book option number A is also correct so when I refer other option like here you can be able to see option number 963 which consists of A, B, C so in that cases only those students that might be changing of option 962 to 963 therefore marks will be awarded for those students who are selected option ID 963 that is both uh, that is three option A option B option C option are correct okay so if you are selected 962 means you absolutely you'll be getting a negative marking only if you are selected 963 alone you will be getting additional four mark or four mark okay next is regarding to question number 230 that is with regarding to high analysis of ATP okay so they had given a you can you replication related question so in the provision answer key they just mentioned option number 920 is correct option so that is with regarding to this particular thing so they here they had given a eukaryotic DNA replication so in that they had given option ID 920 is correct like in provisional answer key NDS said only B option is here that is DNA stand separation by helicase and joining of Okasaki filament alone require ATP hydrolysis but when I refer question paper so you can watch me watch my solved questions in my previous videos and based on my knowledge clamp fluid association with the clamp and DNA also requires a ATP hydrolysis so when I refer options here you can be able to see option B option C and option number D are absolutely correct. So, in the, for this particular question, they might change the option ID 922 to 918. Therefore, marks will be allotted only for those children who are selected 918 option ID. So, if you had selected option ID 918 alone, you will be getting a 4 mark. So, I have given you an enough amount of calculation. So, thank you friends. Thanks for watching this video.